Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Bethany, and today I'm gonna do a Christmas haul. Um, I got a comment asking for one, so I'm gonna do one. Um, um, and yeah. So first of all, I'm gonna start with um this. I got this from my friend. Um, it's so cute. It's cute. Um, but the only reason I'm starting with this right now because I kind of gotta like block my sweater. Anyways, and then I'm going to show you guys this really quick because that's what I'm holding the camera on. And then I also got this from her a couple days after. Um, we kind of just gave each other a bunch of presents throughout, like, December. Like, all throughout December. So, we were, like, giving each other presents everywhere. It was fun. And it was so hard. And a lot of the stuff we literally just found around our house and we are like, here you go. Um, but one of my favorite things I got from her is this bracelet. And I love it so much. And I'm so afraid I'm going to break it. So I hate wearing it. <laughs> but I love it. It's so cute. And then that cross. I'm like, oh. It's just, I have to fix the letters. Because I want to make sure they don't mess up. <laughs> okay, so this. Um, and then my papa. I got $25 for my papa. Um, let me think. Who gave me that? Oh, got this from my brother. I will probably be using beads because I make and um, sell bracelets. So this will probably work well for selling bracelets and stuff like that. But got that, and then that was from the Tico Tano. But I'm showing them anyways because they like. One of the things, oh, okay, so this is one of my favorite presents, and when I saw it, I literally was like, I was so happy. So I got this, it was like, um, in a box, but I've been using them already, so, um, they're already out. But I got the gel cleanser, and the balancing moisturizer, and the balancing mist. Um, actually, I'm going to use a little bit, because I want to. I love that smell. Don't fall. No. Yeah, so that I got from my brother. Um, and then. Um, okay. So this was from my brother. And it's like a rock cooler. And I've been wanting one so bad. Um, I'm just going to show you a couple of the rocks that came with. I made a little bit of them. But this one I thought was so cool. It's like green and then it has that black. And even this side looks cool. I love this one so much. Um, and then I like the green ones. They just look cool. Like that one is so smooth. Um, and I'll just grab a handful to show you guys. So you can see. But all these, um, this one it looks also really cool. Um, yeah. This like grabs all the green ones. No, the green ones are like my favorites. Okay, there is one that's not green that I love. Cheetah. There's this one, and it has, like, these cool lines on it, and it's smooth, and I just love the color. It looks cool. Um, and then I also got a... Oh, wow, I almost fell. Okay, and then I got this. Um, bunch of, like, tons stuff for... That went with another present I got, which is a... Machine. Little mini one. It's, I've tried, kind of tried, but um, yeah. So this, and then how are you? Uh, I don't know where to put this. Oh yeah, I'll just put it back over here. <laughs> I don't want to fall down there. Okay. And then I also got a Bible from my friend as well. Um, and then let's see. Wait. I also got a devotional from my mom, but I can't find that. It's like a teen girl devotional thing, but I'm so excited. I need to find it today, though, because I want to read it, but I don't have that yet. And then I got this, like, really cute little basket. I love it. Um, but there's, like, if I can even open it, um, it has all, it has, like, this jewelry kit thing and all that. It has... Like pockets, I'm probably 
you could probably poke needles in there and store it. I don't even know if that's what it's for, but I'm actually going to put this in here. Just so it's out of play. One last thing or two. And then you got this nice stuff bag. Oh, and stuff just fell out of it. Um, why is there's money in it? Uh, but, anyways, yeah, this little bag. Um, and then, alright, so I got this thing. And I already, like, okay. I'll show you. I have the worst, I'm not even getting the worst handwriting like ever, especially for my age. So, um, I have, like, I mean so bad that a, five-year-old could write better than me. I'm trying to find what I was looking at. Okay, but in my defense, the markers I was using also really suck. Like, the ones it came with. I mean, it doesn't suck. I mean, they're the markers you're supposed to use. It's just going to take, like, a lot of practice to get used to, which I haven't practiced, like, at all, so it's going to be harder. But, um, then I'll show you what they look like. So you know what I mean. So then I just have different sizes, but they have, like, this one. And the way the tip is, oh, gosh, I don't know if that'll catch it. The way the tip is, it's, like, pointy. Um, and they have like one side that like goes down in a weird way i don't know how to explain it um i'll show you a bigger one the other two though because they have different like sizes or whatever and so like this one and then this one but um they when you're writing with them it like, doesn't work as good so now but i have i'm gonna show you i'm not gonna be embarrassed and i'm gonna show you my um well it's not working my thing that i wrote on here so i'm like go to this i could blame it on the tips but i think i also just no so we have like right here we have uh we'll start with the a you can see that so the A, so like you draw like the start and you copy that and you draw the first line. And then you copy this and you draw the second line on both of them. And then the third one, um, or whatever. And like, that's how you do it throughout the whole thing. And I'm like, I, so bad at handwriting. I can't, I'm trying to practice, but I'm like, I, um, so hard like you know it's just really hard to like focus I guess and it's like really hard but that's something like I've always struggled with this school but then we have um, let me see okay right. so that was like my presents I got from like Mainly siblings, actually. No. That's so sad. My uh, stuff dropped. Some of my stuff dropped down there. Okay, I'm putting it in there because I have to get my other things that dropped too. Okay, so. Oh, and another thing I got that's actually down here that. I was on top of my bed. <laughs> so I gotta put this away. We got like these little, I'll show you in a second. They're like these little houses. Yeah. And they're like little money banks because we have like our spending, savings, and then, uh, like tides, giving and stuff. So I have the, they're like these tiny little houses. And I had to put my 25 in there. And I have another one too, um, which is tied. Um, it kind of fell apart. So that's my tied one. 
wait, where is it? Okay, right there. That's my tied one. Um, and then we have bending and or it might be actually it might be the other way around for these two but the one i just showed you was bending i think and then this one's short short term saving i'm pretty sure um i'm like so upset i can't find that journal because if i don't read it today then i'm gonna lose my mind um i'm gonna reach down here and grab this really good Okay, I don't like, you know what, we're gonna just show you one of the other presents right now, because I have to open this. Okay, so, I don't know if you'll be able to see it actually from here. So, okay, that basketball hoop right there, that was one present. And then we got a, um, part of our, like, present for the basketball hoop is, like, we're building a, we're gonna build, like, a concrete pad and get a like basketball thing built in and i'm like so excited because i actually really like basketball um and i'm not that good at it i suck in my own ways like my brothers are a lot better than me but for somebody who barely ever practices i think i'm pretty good um at least i can make it in the basket um so i'm like really excited though because like then i can practice better and stuff because like here you literally cannot pass it, practice it like at all and so i'm so excited but and then another present we got was um a like these net things for soccer kind of they're not the like big ones that you see at parks and stuff they're like little plastic ones kind of um that just go around or not yeah like they just go around they have like little nets on them so there's that and then um and then we got like a frisbee golf uh just month stand but we got a frisbee golf stand thing and that one's really fun because i play that with my brother-in-law and it's so fun um and then we got a infinity game board i don't know if you guys know what that is but it's like kind of a big tablet kind of pretty much and then um you can like play board games on it and it's so fun because you can't lose pieces and i love that because um something you guys should know about us is we cannot have games in this house or they will like break and we'll lose pieces so that's a big reason we don't have games is because we lose pieces so this was like a perfect present um and then okay so that's all for the Christmas off, but um, I want to share something with you guys. So, as you guys probably know, um, I have a horse named Dolly. Um, I love her. Um, I also don't know if you guys noticed, but I deleted one of my videos that I made saying that like I was gonna um like. Um, I need to think how to word this. I made a short, um, on one of the things that was saying, like, oh, how I'd never get rid of Dolly. Like, she's my baby and stuff, but, um, she's not the best for riding, and I love her so much, but, um, she's also... She's a Mustang, and for, like, I don't know, she is, I love her so much, and I, I always say, oh, like, I'd never get rid of her, like, love her too much for that, like, she's my baby, like, that type of thing, and, like, and it's really hard, but, um, I decided to do barrel riding, and I, in order to do barrel riding, I had to sell her, um, Oh, I won't have her anymore. Um, I will be selling her and getting a new horse. It hits different when you say it out loud. Um, it's so hard because I love her. We've already made the decision. 
I don't know what was reading yet, but reading a horse that will work for riding because she probably doesn't ride very well. Oh, this is so hard. Never had to sell a horse for anything, so it's kind of hard. Because she was our first, um, our first source. <laughs> She's always been, like, my horse. That's always what we've called her. And literally from the moment we got her, I fell in love with her right away. <laughs> and this is gonna really suck. But it'll be good for later on. Uh, we're starting a farm business, so we need a horse that'll be good for people. And right now she's staying at our neighbor's house, so um, we don't have, we don't, we can't go over and like say hi to her all the time. And I haven't really been around her much, and she doesn't really like, um, she knows me, but she doesn't. She doesn't like, I can't just go over and she'll instantly remember me. Like, she won't walk up to me or anything. I have to go walk up to her because she, like, I don't know. It's just really hard. But, um, the hardest part will be that she was her first horse. And that I'll never be able to forget her. But, um, because we're doing a farm business and doing farm tours and stuff. Um, and because, like... My mom's really happy because my mom also wanted me to do barrel racing. Um, I'm excited, but I, Dolly, I knew instantly Dolly wouldn't work for barrel racing. She's not that type of horse. She, when she's done riding, she's done riding. She doesn't want to ride anymore. And she's really good. And when we got her, she was really good too. Like, her owner was really good with her, but she's never been the best, like, horse to ride just because she's not used to that stuff um very much so um like since we got her it's like I can't we've been so busy that I can't go over and say hi and I want her to have a home where she can um she can go and like see people like she can have a family that'll be able to spend all their time with her um so yeah that's all but Thank you guys so much for your support and for being so understanding. Um, this is hard, but I'm going to get through it. Um, um, I will... I don't know when this is all happening right now, but... For now, I don't know. Because, like... One of the biggest reasons, too, is, like, she's over at the neighbor's, and she doesn't do well with cars driving by or anything, and so we have to walk her, like, outside the neighbor's fence to get to our fence, and even just to our fence, if a car passes, like, she'll freak out, she doesn't like that stuff, and, like, there was one point where I, like, was walking her, and, like, my mom was at our house, and I was, like, over by the neighbor's fence or whatever, and then, like, she was almost, like, got out of my hands because, like, she doesn't like that type of stuff, she doesn't like cars or loud noises, and so, she was, I didn't really, like, she started freaking out. And so, my mom had to come and help me. And stuff like that. So. But, that's all. Um, thank you guys, again, for your support. Um, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Just remember, Jesus loves you.